faces are vulnerable ahead of the Eid Fetter. And Sai International Foundation has supported some elderly women within the Kanaishi Zongo with food items worth over 30,000 cities in order for them to feel secured, especially during the COVID-19 pandemic. The Ansara International Foundation, a non-governmental organization, visited the Kanishi Zongo and donated to the needy and less privileged in the community, even as Muslims approach Edo Fetal. The over 30,000 cities worth of items include bags of rice, sugar, cooking oil, spaghetti and many more. Imam Izu Dean Suleimana is the head of the Ansa International Foundation in Ghana. Ansar International, as you know, is a very big NGO from Germany. And as you can see what we are doing today, we have um, distribution of bag of rice, we have onions, we have oils, and we have spaghetti. This is what we do. Due to the COVID-19, any place we go, we find so many, we, 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 we see that people are in need, they are in hunger, but the authorities are not giving us the chance to distribute. They said that uh, because of this social gathering, we don't have to do this. So sometimes we go to the communities, they are in need, but we can't distribute it. So I think the NGOs in Ghana need so much support from the government. The occasion was also used to advise the Muslim Ummah to obey directives laid down by government in order to stay safe. Um, we should all think about what is happening and we should also follow the rules of the government because the government said um, no, we shouldn't gather together as we did to, you know, gather together, go to the independence and do so many things. We have to allow, uh, we have to follow the, the order of the government because even in Islam we have Adaruratu to be Hul Mahzurat. When something comes, then it's okay to do what we have to do so we can all pray, you know, in our local homes and, you know, even the Eid, you can buy your new clothes that is sunnah, you can wear, walk around, something good. But we should try and avoid riding motorbikes, you know, being together, going to jams, salafis, and all of that. Because even the Christians, at their Easter time, that is what they do. They follow the rules, so I want to advise my fellow Muslims to also follow the rules of the government. Some beneficiaries spoke with Metro News. I'm happy. May Allah bless the one who is doing this zakat. It's going to help a lot of us because there are some who don't have, but others who have. But all the same, with this lockdown, it's going to help because most of us are not going out. We are all in. So may Allah bless that person. The leaders of the Ansa International Foundation called on other benevolent organizations to contribute their widow's might to the less privileged and vulnerable.